We are interrupting your regularly scheduled programming for breaking news. We now know the punishment for the former Tyler nurse who was convicted of capital murder. William Davis has been sentenced to death. He was convicted of capital murder last week for the deaths of four patients. Davis did this while working as a nurse at the Christus Trinity Mother Francis Heart Hospital. Prosecutors say he injected the patients with air on purpose. Now here's a recap of what has happened in the last few days of the sentencing phase. Family members of William Davis victims ended Smith County prosecutors case that William Davis should be sentenced to death. The defense team began their plea for him to be sentenced to life without parole. Now his legal team faced an uphill battle due to a large number of victims in the case, as well as some incriminating phone calls. The defense did call a handful of witnesses, including Davis's brother, old football coach and high school friend. We now go to KDK's Lauren Margolis, who has been following this case for us. Now, Lauren, how was the reaction in the courtroom when it was announced that William Davis will be put to death? Well, Sarah, it was a shock and the jury came to the decision just moments ago. Now, this has been several years of delays, which has arguably been one of the most high profile trials East Texas has seen in a decade. District Attorney Jacob Putman's team of prosecutors called dozens of witnesses over the past few weeks, which included family members of the victims, surgeons and nurses. During the sentencing phase, Putman called more victims who survived to testify for a total of 12. He also brought up one Possible new victim from 2016 that was revealed after a jail phone call from Davis. Despite pleas from his attorneys for mercy, the jury sentenced him to be executed. And hear what Put Putman had to say at 4 on KTK and 5:30 on Fox 51. I'm live in front of the Smith County Courthouse. Lauren Margolis, KTK News. Lauren, thank you very much for that update. Now, here in a few minutes, Smith County District Attorney Jacob Putman will be holding a press conference. Now, he's going to be discussing the conclusion of this capital murder trial and we will be live streaming that press conference on our website that's kdk.com and the kdk mobile app we will also be carrying this press conference live right here on the air on kdk and fox 51 we will also have the latest reaction to this trial this afternoon on kdk news at 4 and fox 51 news at 5 30. thank you very much for joining us we'll see you in a couple of hours